Hi, I'm Jared Brownridge here with uh, Gonzaga's player Kevin Pangos. Uh, Kevin, just wanted to talk to you a little bit. Only played against you a few times, considering it's been my freshman year. Uh, just wanted to pick your brain a little bit. Uh, I know, considering the fact that we're both shooters, we we have things that we look for as shooters. For me, it's uh, hand down, man down. I'm sure you've heard that phrase before. And also getting my feet uh, squared to the basket. What are some things that you look for as a shooter? Uh, for me, it's just space. If, if I got space, I'm probably going to let that thing go. So. Um, yeah, for me, if I if I get open, shots going up. I wouldn't disagree with that. <laughs> I go to Santa Clara, where Steve Nash is from, Santa Clara alum. Have you ever got a chance to spend time with him in Canada ever? Yeah, he came back and he worked a training camp with our, our Team Canada team and talked to a bunch of the guys. He's a really laid back dude and stuff. So, um, yeah, he you know we picked his brain as much as we could because obviously two-time MVP, he's, he knows yeah. a lot. Really cool, really cool. What are some things uh, that you can give me advice on for like a winning culture? Something that I could take back to my team in the locker room that I can say to my guys. Because considering that Gonzaga, you know, is a, a winning culture, you guys win a lot every year. What are some things that you can give to me to help me out? I don't want to spit any hints, man. <laughs> you guys almost beat us last year, and you almost scored 30 something on us. So. <laughs> But you guys still got the W, so you got to give me something to go back with. Well, I'm going to keep it with nothing and just say, stop dropping 30 points uh, on us. That, that's it. That's it? I don't get anything? That's it. That's All right. It. <laughs> well, there you have it. I guess I don't get any inside information. I'm going to have to figure it out. Kevin Pangos. Uh, what would you say your coaching style is for going into uh, college? Oh, I would just say the teacher first and just – Kind of taking young guys through the process, not only of how to play the game, but being more professional in the way that they treat their bodies or what's coming next. And then also the development of character, and that usually comes with the other players on your team. Making selection where peer pressure is in a good way it helps that young guy become a young man. Since I'm a big fan of Michael Jordan, what is it like uh, just being around him just uh, when he's not being competitive? Uh, in terms of his general smarts and how he sizes up a room, I've never seen anybody smarter or better or more gracious. His humility is off the charts. Uh, in terms of his competitiveness and the way he is, uh, same thing. There's no doubt in my mind that if, as the Hornets go on here, they'll win a championship because of his personality and his persistence.